So this is my uh, HTC, HTC Desire Z, currently running uh, or accessing internet over Wi-Fi, as you can see on those bit of mobile signal too. So let's have a look at the Wi-Fi settings, Wi-Fi, Wi-Fi settings, and you can see we've got network, my network connected. We've got BT Open Zone H, unable to connect. Please tap to try again. BT Fon. Open Network, BT Open Zone, Open Network. So if I tap BT Open Zone H, come up with a little dialog box, says Connect, Forget or Cancel. So we click on Forget, and then it's got Open Zone H, Open Network, BT Fon, Open Network, BT Open Zone, Open Network. Okay, so let's do something else. Let's just click, come out of the screen. Let's check the weather. Okay, Daventry is currently partly sunny. Okay, let's go back. Go back to Wi-Fi settings. Wi-Fi settings. BT Open Zone this time. Unable to connect, please tap to try again. Now that was previously just an open network. Open Zone 8, remembered open network. So somehow the forget hasn't forgotten. So let's forget that one. And let's forget that one. So... BT Farn Open Network, BT Open Zone H Open Network, and that's all. Our oh, Open Zone popped up, Open Network. Oh, BT Open Zone connected. Very strange. So let's go on to that. No way of disconnecting. Let's try going onto here, onto my network. Let's try connecting with it. Wi-Fi disconnected, scanning, connecting. Oh, it's gone back to BT Open Zone H for some reason. BT Open Zone H connected. So let's go back to my network. NN6, CN, etc, etc. Connect. Wi-Fi disconnecting, scanning, connecting. Obtaining IP address from BT Open Zone H. Connecting to BT Open Zone H. Well, let's try going back to that. No way to forget or disconnect, it says cancel. So let's try disconnecting from Wi-Fi. Reconnecting to Wi-Fi. Obtaining IP address connected to BT Open Zone H. And just to show you what happens with it connected to BT Open Zone H, go into the browser. Trying to find Google. Can't find Google. Let's force it. So that should find me Google. Let's see what's going to happen. Nothing at all at the moment because, of course, Open Zone BT Open Zone is a paid for or subscription service, and I don't have a subscription. Let's try going back to the tabs. Let's try accessing Google. So, effectively, with my phone connecting to Open Zone. I'm not able to use the internet. It won't connect over mobile phone because it thinks it has a Wi-Fi connection. So let's have another go then at Wi-Fi settings. Wi-Fi settings. Open zone connected. Ah, we've got forget this time. It's very strange. Disconnected. Scanning, connecting. I don't know what's happening there. Let's force close that. Obtaining IP address, connecting to BT Open Zone. And let's try again. Let's go to mine, tell it to connect. Scanning, connecting, obtaining IP address from BT Open Zone. Let's just try disconnecting there. Turn on Wi Fi. And uh, let's go into BT Open Zone, forget, do you want to 
boot up pro or during the connection process. What's going to happen now? It says disconnected, scanning, connecting, back to VT open zone. VT open zone, forget, disconnect, scanning, connecting. Ah, oh, it's gone into my network now. There you go, isn't life strange sometimes? So let's just wait for it to obtain the address. And wait. It does seem to connect a bit faster to BT Open Zone, but then I suppose there's no security, so it doesn't need to exchange any security credentials. There it goes. So it's on my network, and just to demonstrate that, if I go back to the browser, There's a browser home page, and if I go back to Google, and I think we decline. Okay, so what I'm going to do now is go back to settings, have a look at what the Wi Fi settings are. BT Open Zone H, unable to connect. Now remember, the, we've got these, so let's forget them again. BT Open Zone itself is remembered, so let's forget that. So we've got Open Zone H. Ah, for some reason it's connecting. It baffles me somewhat. Because if you look at the signal strength indication, you can see BT Open Zone is negligible signal. And in fact, it says signal strength is poor. Whereas if you look at my network, it says signal strength is excellent. So it's not that the BT Open Zone signal is stronger. Just for some reason, the phone likes it better. Let's just try connecting. Connecting. No, BT Open Zone H again. Switch off. Switch back on. Obtaining address, let's go and try and forget it while it's doing that. Disconnected. Scanning. Connecting. No idea why that Vodafone thing is coming up. BT Open Zone. Let's... We've got a forget option this time. Scanning. Connecting. BT Open Zone. Let's go back in. We've got no forget option this time. Very, very strange. Turn off Wi-Fi. Turn on Wi-Fi. Connecting to Open Zone. Let's try to forget that. Disconnected scanning. Connecting. Connecting to my network. No, it says now connected to my network. What I'm going to do at this point is turn my router off for about 10 seconds and then back on. This is just to simulate um, the phone going out of range of the router. And sure enough, it's, it's dropped the connection to Open Zone to um, my router, which is back on the list at the moment. Not in range remembered. Ah, now it's come back, remembered, but it continue. It keeps the connection to Open Zone H. So if I went out of range of my router or had some um, obstruction between myself and my router, the phone would switch itself over to Open Zone H and I would lose any ability to get any email or other internet notifications because of course those won't come through 
unless you're subscribed to Open Zone H. Let's try just one last time. Ah, oh, there's no forget option at the moment. Um, so what, let's go to my network and try connect. Disconnected, scanning, connecting, Open Zone H. Try again. Connect. And I'll take let's see if we can No, we're not getting any response at all, are we? Connect to that. Open zone H, no cancel option, or no forget option. No forget option. Still no forget option. Not much of a cancel option. Call it a day.